I'm delighted to be able to say that the Belfast International Arts Festival is back on again this year. It's great to see so many excellent, high quality literature events. You'll find them on their website under the Talks and Ideas stand. Um, you know, I, there are a number of high profile international authors, but I'd like to shine a light a little bit on the Northern Irish authors who are present. And, um, you know, I'd start with um, the, the wonderful event with uh, Lucy Caldwell and John Carson. Uh, both talking about the short story form which the two are celebrated in. Um, they both have new collections out, um, both write for radio and um, as well as write novels and um, you know I think that they'll, they'll have a wide ranging conversation on, about literature and about the short story form so I'm really looking forward to that. Um, we have um, Roy Doyle of course is, uh, is always a big draw, always a hugely entertaining conversation and he also talks about very important issues in his work, um, the working class issues and uh, poverty and um, I think that uh, he's, he's got a new collection of short stories as well uh, and uh, I'd be very interested to uh, find out about that at the festival. Um, I'd also like to mention uh, Susan McKay. I'm a massive fan of her writing. Um, you know, one of um, one of our finest minds, and um, she's uh, got a new book um, on shifting ground, which is uh, where she has interviewed um, the members of the Protestant community all around Northern Ireland, and it really is a fascinating book um, and very um, insightful and illuminating. Um, and, uh, and, and, a, and a final mention to um, uh, Karen Doherty, who's um, Thin Places. Um, um, I read earlier this year and was just completely blown away uh, by it's a, um, a nature um, memoir um, that covers identity, uh, history, culture, um, and uh, it's it's moving and um, it's uh, thoughtful and it. It's just beautifully written, and I don't think you'll, uh, I don't think you'll be disappointed if you tune in there. I'm really interested to hear how she speaks on it. So um, I really do hope you come and see some of the events at the festival, and I'm looking forward to it myself.